Hola amigos, today we're going to be reviewing the Cruiser Blade USB flash drive. It is cheap as chips. I actually got it free with my Hoyer lens, whatever the hell it is. I'm going to tell you how good it is. If it can handle 4K streaming, can we put windows on this thing? Boom, shot. It looks nice and sexy. Look at that, beautiful. The Cruiser Blade 32 gigabytes made in China. SanDisk looks kind of nice. Let's see how fast it rocks. So as you can see, this puts the AF in slow, slow as hell. It killed my Adja. Adja just would not respond. Look at it, six megabytes a second writing. What are we using? A floppy disk up in here. Disk speed. Yeah, reading 25. It's all right. You know, it's okay. Look at that write speed. Pathetic, pathetically slow. You might be thinking, oh, okay, Ash, this is a cheap as chips USB. How about a decent one? It's another one by SanDisk. It's actually smaller. And uh, write speed, as you can see, boom, shakalaka. Look at that, we're getting 50, 50 megabytes a second write. That's 10 times faster than that piece of crap we were using a second ago. And reading, look at that amazingness. 150 megabytes a second. That's pretty damn good for a crappy USB. A USB, whatever it is. Nothing compared to my MacBook Pro. MacBook Pro SSD just kills the performance. But you guys want to know. Can this crappy little USB, what are they called, wherever they are, can they run Windows 10? And the answer is... There you go. As you can see, that little drive there is booting Windows up. Not as fast as a proper SSD, but it works nonetheless. So as you can see, the worst USB stick in the history of the world. Bigger than my small one, slower than my small one, but at least it runs Windows. But you know, for... Basic USB stuff, copying Word documents and that kind of crap. It's a decent card, considering I got it for free. Looks kind of nice with the red trim. Suits my Mustang. So I'm not going to complain too much, but let me know in the comment section below. What is your worst USB stick that you've ever used in your life? Have you ever stuck it somewhere that you don't want to stick it anymore? Viruses, that kind of stuff. Actually, don't let me know about that stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed the show.